Well, hey guys, my name is Dana. Thanks for joining my channel tonight. I'm so excited to share with you our latest and greatest updates of our country home. We have been renovating for a little over 45 days now. We've moved into our country home and we've made some progress this week. So I know you guys are waiting for an update. So thanks for being so patient. And please know that we're gonna probably do one to two updates per week as of right now, as we continue to transform this into our home. So take a look at what we've been doing this past Last week though. All right guys, we are gonna start here in the pantry to show you guys the update. We have our shelving unit in the pantry. We also have our food put away except for our canned goods. We have bought one of these closet made um, wall units to put on the wall right here to house all of our canned goods. And then when we were in Kansas City with our large pantry, I used our Your Way cubes that I sell with 31 gifts to store um, all the items to make the shelves not look so cluttered and I actually could store more using these cubes. So my goal is to get another one up here on this shelf um, and then some on the top and then use some of our Your Way rectangles to store items on this shelf here. So this will look a lot different probably the next time, but right now some of those are being used to, we, we use them to move stuff to be honest. So for now this works, but progress is being made. Um, I need to paint the trim around this door and the door leading into the bathroom. So those are the last two pieces of brown trim. Still have not gotten that done, but other things have come first. Um, leading into the kitchen, we have a stove. Aren't you guys excited? Um, our stove is here. It's awesome. It's not hooked up, but it's so pretty just sitting there and I'm so happy. Um, our microwave is also here. There's the back side of it in our dining room. It's on the dining room table. Um, so a couple things we had to do with the microwave. We had to rotate the fan so that it could be above the stove and not go out the top of the roof of the house. Um, we also found that the um, plug-in is on the top, not on the back side. So we had put this plug-in here because I thought the microwave plugged into the wall this way, but it sits flush against the wall. So now we have to go up through this cabinet here and redo some wiring. So just another hiccup in the road. Um, our countertops are all attached, except you guys can see it's not attached on this piece yet because um, we're still waiting to hook up our stove with gas. Um, but all of our cabinets we have filled. It's fantastic. I have a Lazy Susan and it's not perfect, but it's full and awesome. And um, I love that it's something I can put the bigger stuff in. So that's super fun. The countertops are holding up really well. I'm going to do an Insta story here soon on how to care for them, but our sink is in and we have running water. Hold on. I know you guys want to see. She do. It's awesome. It's awesome, awesome, awesome. So this is a large commercial sized um, stainless steel sink. It is 28 inches, nice and deep. I did not want a sink with a divider. Um, I really wanted to go stainless, and so I really love how it fits into this kitchen perfectly. Um, and I love that it fits over the edge of our counter um, so that hopefully no water penetrates onto our wood countertops. The um, blind actually comes tomorrow, so we will hopefully have that up on our next video. Okay, so our dishwasher is here, our TV is here. The TV we actually used in our garage in Kansas City, so it's gonna go up here. The dishwasher is here, and we hope to start building the backside of the um, peninsula this week. So that will change, and then I can start painting. So that's super exciting. Um, dining room, not a lot has changed. Not a lot at all. Need to paint the dining room table and I'm gonna paint this piece over here, but for now it's just gonna stay in the same. And then I will take you into both the bedrooms. Okay, the back porch. I um, did a video earlier and I don't know why it didn't record. So let's try this again, guys. Um, this is the back porch leading into the kitchen. It is our soon to be mudroom. And we took off the um, drywall here that um, face on the wall facing the kitchen. So we can go in through this way and hopefully adjust the wiring for the microwave and get the microwave installed. We can also um, hopefully hook up the gas to the stove 
um, sooner rather than later. So that's exciting because we have taken off this wall. Um, these walls, this wall here and the wall with the door and the window and the wall leading into the basement, those walls are going to stay. Um, we may just panel over them or we may just paint them. I'm not sure which we're going to go for. Um, here is where the stackable washer and dryer are going to go. We actually picked them up yesterday from Lowe's. Um, so now we just need to get everything fixed up so that we can get them in here and our laundry going. The plan for the back porch is there is a plug in here and there's that hookup for the washer and dryer. So they will be stackable here along the wall in the kitchen. And then I want to have like a bench right next to it so that as you come in from the back porch, you can put your shoes on or off and sit on the bench and then some shoe storage as well. So that is the plan for this area here. Here is the master bedroom. As you can see, it's nothing fancy right now. We have a couple of end tables. We have our bed, um, which is actually sitting on the floor. Um, sometimes I really like it being so close to the floor. So um, we definitely need some updated pillowcases and new bedding and things, but and Lucy loves our bed. She has been spooked since we lived here. So she sleeps on our bed with us. We're hoping for a good night of sleep, aren't we, Luce? Yes. Um, these are a couple of the original MDT tables that my husband built me when we first started our business. So my plan is to paint these, add a little pop of color in this room. This um, dresser um, is actually my grandparents' dresser and I spray painted it black years ago after um, my grandpa had passed away. And so it came with us with this move from Kansas City and then the move from the duplex to here. Houses our TV for now. Um, I definitely would love a little bit of a larger piece to store our clothing in, but we do have this air vent to deal with and we've got laundry stored there. So for now it works. I may paint this or I may find something else. I don't know. Um, the closet is working really well and I apologize if this is a repeat, but um, I love it because everything is here. So we have our closet um, organized, his on top, hers on the bottom. Um, we have some extra storage, and then I've got some of my Your Way cubes, again, that we used in our house in Kansas City. I just need to get some things organized and put away, and I'll be able to walk clear to the very back. So this is the closet. Okay, and then this is the guest bedroom, which we have kind of turned into a office for me um, because... I do my 31 business and I'm able to work with an MDT business here at home. So I've got my laptop set up on a desk and got a couple of chairs in here. We've actually turned this closet into my storage closet for all of our 30, my 31 gifts items. This uh, cabinet that was originally gonna go in the kitchen now houses all of my items for 31 inside of it. So um, this does need to get a little bit more organized, but. As you can see, I have a lot of 31 gifts items. And then we have these shelves up top, which I'm so glad we kept because it's housing all of my other goodies of 31 up there. So it's a full, complete shelf and closet. And thank goodness I have it. Okay, there you have it. That's a wrap. Hopefully you guys like the updates. Keep watching. I think we're going to be doing about one to two updates a week as we continue to transform this into our home. And we look forward to sharing more with you soon. So if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, be sure and hit subscribe so you don't miss the latest and greatest updates. Talk to you soon.